hey welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to use quickbooks with ebay let's begin okay so the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here in quickbooks just click on the create account option and from here all you have to do is just follow the on-screen instructions provide all the information and you are all set now we could do the same thing with quickbooks log in using your credentials you need to find a plan that's right for you and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you are all set now quickbooks integration with ebay automates the recording of sales fees and expenses this eliminates the need for manual data entry saving time and reducing the risk of errors in accounting now once you are here in your dashboard just go to the left side panel of your and click on the find apps and all we have to do is just type in ebay and hit enter because by syncing eBay transactions with QuickBooks, businesses can track their financial performance in real time. Now, this provides accurate insights into sales, expenses, and profit margins, enabling better decision making. And from here, if you're interested to know more about the key benefits and the pricing, it's a limited, it's free, and the honest and transparent reviews to help you more to make help to help you make an informed decision and once you have done that just click on the get app now and from here as you can see while it's loading up quickbook will integrate streamlined tax reporting for ebay sales now business can categorize transactions track sales tax and generate reports necessary for tax filing directly within the quickbooks making tax preparation more efficient and from here by selecting connect you agree that you share your quickbooks online data with ebay connector by intuit all right if you don't if you want to know more just hover down in the option menu right here and just click on connect now it's a very straightforward process because from here all you have to do is just follow the on-screen instructions right now automating financial process through quickbooks integration saves time reduce admin cost associated with manual data entry here in ebay and of course this will allow you as a business owner to focus more on core activities such as product sourcing marketing and customer engagement right now once you are here all you just need to do is just tweak the settings and provide as much as information as you want and you're all good click on the connect to ebay now the next option is to use a zapier because from here we can create integrations between ebay and quickbooks online to automate any workflow and by connecting these apps you can have these endless possibilities like it when you have a new order it can send a sales receipt just click on the orange button and once you've done that we will have a separate in-depth tutorial about eBay and um, QuickBooks. But for now, the summary is you can rename the app and click on the eBay here. Because you can choose an event. Say, for example, it triggers when a new order is made. All right, click on it. And then hover to QuickBooks Online. Now here, all you have to do is choose an event as well. Say, for example, you can choose multiple items that you can do for the event. Now, I'm going to be using create a new bill optionally tied to a customer with line item support. When you do that, all you have to do now from here is just click on continue because when you click on continue, these will automate and authenticate the apps themselves. Now, you can sit back and relax because Zapier will do all the work for you, right? Another option that we have in mind is using Cinder because from here you can connect eBay QuickBooks online integration for accurate accounting. Automatically integrates eBay payout data with QuickBooks online. You can get a summary of your sales, fees, taxes, and more by payout period. And you can have confidence that your eBay numbers in QuickBooks online are right. And from here, all you have to do is log in or try A2X for free. And I believe that's a wrap for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next video.